race three for Trotters. Human Go was shuffled. Maudine Starr from Fairmount Park to Kismodo fully completely goes for three straight. ...to grab the lead. Maudine Starr is away well, looking to drop into the two-hole in second. Lady Enid trotted out smoothly in third. Fully completely fourth, Bimini Action the Gray has gone off stride. Royal Pharaoh on the inside races in fifth position. Kobe Prakis parked out in sixth. Out of credit on the inside seventh, Fool's Goal has gone on a break. GV's Delmonica was rough-gated and is further back, and the trailer is Bimini Action. Opening quarter on the board in 28 and 3. They head to the backstretch now, and O'Donnell has come and go on the lead by a length and a half. In behind him, Maudine Starr getting a nice drafting trip from Sackett. Lady Enid tracks that pair third, about three lengths from the front. Fully, completely, now tips to the outside, coming first up from fourth. Royal Pharaoh on the inside, Kobe Prakis has live cover to follow. In behind horses, racing in seventh is out of credit as they trot past the half-mile marker, and they reach that station in one minute and one-fifth. Then further back, racing in eighth is GV's Del Monica, followed by Bimini Action, and Fool's Goal is far behind and out of it after that break. They move around the turn nearing the 3 8 marker, and on the inside, continuing to show the way is Come and Go. Fully, completely is at his wheel, applying some moderate pressure in second. Maudine Starr is locked in on the inside in third. Lady Enid is followed along nicely. She's three lengths from the front in fourth, and dropping back a bit is Kobe Prakis on the outside fifth. As they come to the top of the stretch, the three quarters in one thirty and three, and Come and Go is trying to wire the field. Fully, completely put to the whip on the outside as they come to the eighth pole. Come and Go is digging in, fully, completely coming on. No room for Maudine Starr, who now tries the rail. Lady Enid is racing in fourth. It's fully, completely. Lady Enid and Kobe Prank is coming on fully, completely. Hangs on to win it from Lady Enid. I believe Kobe Prank has got up for third. Oh, fully, completely keeps the winning streak alive as he rates very nicely today. We have a horse to watch out of this race. That was the four, Maudine Starr. Locked along the pylons and could not squeeze through. The winner's a four-year-old by Armbro Gold for Dreamland Farms. Gary matches off to a quick start.